don't know when. Oof. Heartbreak for Ferruja. You got to feel for him. It was equal the whole game, pretty much. Just one slip. Much like Nepo yesterday, Hikaru, he doesn't want to spoil this. He knows this is a golden opportunity. What this will do, not just to his tournament standing back to 50%, but to his confidence, kind of a Magnus Carlsen-esque performance. And Rook G8, Ali Reza with just a second on the clock, forgetting about this tactic, G2. And look at that multi-purpose knight on H3. It's controlling the two most important squares in the position. F4, that's the forking square, and G1. That's the promotion square. And Ikaro has one pawn left on the king side. Resignation. Ali Reza Ferruja. His heartbreak continues. There's just something about the candidates. Hikaru Nakamura. What a victory. A game with just endless swings and endless drama to the. In the uh, kind of established way. Um, he's wondering what happens if the game continues, but now he does look away. And yeah, interesting. The kind of. Uh... Contrasting demeanors here, despite the fact the game should end in a draw. But there we go, it is a handshake. And we have the first result of round five. <laughs> it wasn't smooth. Uh, the claim wasn't smooth, the game wasn't smooth, but a draw improbably as Vidit, uh, he makes that critical mistake in a winning position against Fabi. What resilience, what strength of mind for Fabiano to find uh, the best practical defense uh, to pose challenges for Vidit until the very end. And the Indian Grandmaster suffers another frustrating result after two losses in a row, coming so close, oh, so close, to rebounding to 50%, but uh, not making it happen. Folks, we have time scrambles coming up on the other three boards. We don't want to miss any of them, and that's and it. It's, yeah. Ay, ay, ay. It's a queen trade that White is going for, not checkmate, not pushing the pawn. Queen F1, King E6, and then Queen F5 check or Queen F6 check. Wow. Kukesh gets up. He knows it. That's it. Oh. Gets up with one minute and 30 seconds. <laughs> Alpha and move. Abbas of just realizing the problem. You can see it on his face there on the camera. Shake of the head. He missed this last move. He had time, he had three minutes, but Queen G2 there was extremely hard to find. Queen end games are extremely hard in general. And uh, wow, what drama. It's gonna be huge for the tournament standings. Yeah, and the narrative is gonna be Abbasov makes the blunder in a drawn position, but let's be real, Queen G2, Queen E5, uh, would Abbasov have drawn? Un des coups francs de la dernière chance. Ouais, regarde comment il se lève. Oh là, oh là, 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 là la main dans la poche Ouais, ok, c'est... Et t'as vu il... Ouais, ok, je ah vois... Ouais. Oh, 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 la prestance, là Oh, oh ouais. le level, c'est ah, incroyable C'est magnifique Et je remets pas mon siège parce que je te crache un peu à la gueule, quand même Ouais, important Et regarde, et regarde... Ah, il peut être Oh my, oh, I got a jump scare. Oh, I got a jump scare. Oh, I got a jump scare. I didn't realize. <laughs> I didn't realize. Seconds just making sure you're not hallucinating and that fearsome look said it all. King h6, queen h2 mate, king g4. There is a check on f5, a boss of, you just, you can't hide your emotions after six hours of defense only to see it all come crashing down Queen g5 and queen f5 is going to bring the curtains down one last time. What a disaster for Abbasov. He could have saved the game, but it, from a practical point of view, it was almost impossible to do so, I believe. Yeah, and congratulations to Gukesh, to Gukesh for perseverance and showing great stamina there. Earning it the hard way, 87 moves. Long, long marathon, that one. <laughs> wow. And I think Judith's prediction of two decisive games, exactly the way we thought it was going to happen, move for move, really.
<laughs> it feels pretty good. It feels pretty good. Not gonna lie. Okay. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. Very good stuff. Okay. <clears throat> nice, okay. Good move. To do. He's got to give a check. Maybe rook a8. Five seconds on the clock. Got to make a move. Three seconds, two. Okay, that... And he's made it. He's taken on D3. He's losing. The... He's blundered. Oh, my gosh. That's it. G3, and the game is over. Hikaru will win. No way. Wow. No way. You see it on the camera immediately. He reacts, Faruja. He just forgot he's walking into a night fork. It's unstoppable. White will lose his rook for the G-pawn. 20 seconds, and he can just resign. It's gone in one move. Nothing to do now. Even Nakamura oh, wow. looks shocked. Naka by the uh, developments there. A check. King Black e6, King just moves. Get out of there. Go as far away from that pawn as possible. The knight will handle it. What a drama. On le ouais, sent, si, si, on le sent. Tu sens tout bien, mais là, ouais, tu regarde, sens pas. Là, tu sens pas, regarde. Oh, regarde, regarde. Voilà. Oh, 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 il est pas bien. Oh, je le connais pour regarder ses streams. Là, il est pas bien quand c'est ça. Deux heures du mat, ça, ça se chauffe. Ça y est. Oh, c'est bouillant. Il ah, n'y a pas besoin de beaucoup hein, pour... Euh... Ah, c'est clair. Maybe decisive is too strong of a word. Or sorry, queen e5, king g8. Uh, queen e5, queen takes a2, and then bishop f5, I meant to say, instead of rook takes h6 check. That, to me is such just such restraint has to be shown uh, in order to play bishop f5 in that position and not grab that pawn on h6. So a lot of people in the chat are, are looking at this thinking the game is over, that's it. You know, Jan is washed. Uh, his candidate's run is over. Wait a second. Let's wait for Prague, first of all, uh, to make the right next few decisions. Um, we know how resilient Jan is. He's already saved an incredibly difficult position against Gukesh. The circumstances there were very different. Yes, of course. But still, <laughs> there's a lot of challenges uh, knocking on Prague's door uh, that he yet has to solve. Well, it's also interesting to see the other players uh, walking by, like uh, Fabiano was uh, checking on this game. Uh, he was standing, and I'm sure he was calculating.